Ah uh, yes, a beautiful and lush lawn gives way to our new house. Ta-da! A lot of people have asked me about our house tour that we usually do, so I thought it was high time for us to do so. Here's our neighbor's house, you can see into our backyard. We were helping them paint up there so we know all of the angles. Here's the other house that is not bought yet, but hopefully we'll get some really nice neighbors. Welcome. Oh. Will, what are you reading? Food and Wine, the magazine. Oh, are you going to make me something good for dinner? Like right Great. Okay, well, here is our house. Um, if you've seen the before pictures, you will know that there's quite a transformation. I'll tell you all about it. You come into our house, remove your shoes if you want to. Well, you don't have to, I guess. Okay, so... First things first, we'll go to the kitchen because that's the everyone's favorite part. Well, it's my favorite part because then we make food. Um, ta-da! So, Will's co-worker has been giving us a lot of produce and she gave us some corn, so we're going to make that pretty soon. Um, I don't know, I don't have anything exciting to say about it, but check out the backyard. So green, so lush, so much lawn to mow. Uh. Oh, we had a big hornet problem, but we've been killing them all. Woohoo! Okay, so come this way, and you will see our big designated music area. The amp is kind of on the fritz right now. It made a scary noise yesterday. I thought it was going to explode our house, but it didn't. So if you come over, you sit here, and you have that speaker and that speaker pointed directly at you. One of these times, this thing is going to be the home of a wood fire stove, but it's super duper expensive, so, um, but we have the hookups, so that'll make it like half the cost. Anyway, um, here's where we line up all our shoes, hangy uppy stuff, a nice gift from Dan. If you're watching this, Dan, thanks. Let's just peek into the garage for a second. We finally managed to get both of our cars in here, but it's a little bit of a squeeze, so we're gonna have to work harder. But we have a nice workstation, a crooked picture. Very good, very good, okay. Will, do you want to lead anybody on part of the tour? Ooh, laundry room. Oh yes. advertisement in this magazine for wet cat food that has gravy in the middle. Like a disgusting cat food fruit gusher. Zoom in on that. That's important. Gross. Why is this in Food and Wine in the magazine? <laughs> we'll stop doing pointless things and instead show okay. us the home. Um, we're, we're still putting up some uh, wall hangings, uh, but we'll get to that. We have some. Yeah, we've, we've got some. We've got some. Mm -hmm. All right, we'll tell, take, okay. take I'll us. I'll show you something very important. Okay. Here's where we keep all our pantry stuff. As you can see, the door kind of just moves back and forth. But we have a very heavy cat thing that holds the door, just in case we need it. Wow, what a friendly cat. Isn't he beautiful? Where'd your hole? All right, take all right. us down the hall. There's a water heater, no, a furnace in here. It's super exciting. I'm sure that you'd love to see it, but maybe now's not the best time. Yeah, okay. Here's a bathroom that is for guests primarily. Whatever. It has a weird curtain rod that comes out, just in case you have an enormous head and a normal-sized people body. This is the guest bedroom that anyone is welcome to come stay in any time. You it's Australia-themed, as you can see. We have the penguin from Australia yeah. and the map from Australia. Ooh, we even have a spider on the screen. It's very thematic. Wait, why is that thematic? Oh, so because Australia. Scares, scares okay. This is a hall closet. It's not that it's exciting. It's not particularly exciting. Yeah. This is a room where we mostly put things that we don't want to deal with. And Rachel works out on this bike and totally doesn't sing karaoke at the television. Shh, that's my secret. Hey. And I put all my guitars in here. Oh yeah, this is like our fun interest room. Everyone was telling us mm -hmm. that we should just have a walk-in room closet. But no, we'll do exercise instead. 
This Did is where I live. Primarily right here. And a beautiful view of the outside. Occasionally you can see the moon from the window at night. You can. It's cool. It's kind of cool. So we have this shed that was just full of a bunch of sketchy wasps. And usually, I mean like actually every day, we have a couple cats that run along. They go kind of along this ridge. They really like it. If you look just to the right of the shed, you can see on the fence, maybe if you have keen eyes. I wonder if I can zoom in. A plastic owl. This job is to keep birds away from a raspberry bush back there. But the cats keep batting it down because they're jerks. Hmm. Anyway. This is the master bathroom, which is very exciting. It's kind of small, but if I look in the mirrors, I can still see you. Fancy towels that were on our wedding registry. Ooh. They're extremely soft. Yes. Yep. Why the video zoomed in so much? Oh, well. Okay. Um, so that's pretty much the entire thing. Now that I've got you here, though, I'm going to show off all the things we did in the house. So if you didn't see before pictures, you could know what we did. So first, ceilings. They were covered with popcorn. Oh, no. Um, so we scraped all that off, sanded it down, retextured stuff. Look at that good texture. Ooh, very nice. Um, so we did all that. We created this doorway where there used to be a wall, and now there's not a wall. Which is pretty cool because then you can kind of make a big loop if you want to. Okay, uh, we, we painted all... what? Let me show you the most important thing. Oh, okay, go. So I changed out essentially every single light fixture, but I installed a dimmer on this one. Hold the phone. In the video, you can't really tell. Perfect ambiance. Okay, now bring it back up. Excellent. Wow, great. So yeah, like th this didn't happen until quite a lot later, but we have light fixture here and here, and this thing was a pain in the butt to put up, and here we'll flick that light. Oh, look at that. It doesn't dim though. It's lame. Yeah. Um, okay, what else did we do? We tore out all of the countertops and replaced it with this bad boy. Um, we rearranged some of the cabinetry. We moved the fridge from here to here. Incredible. Uh, we put up this backsplash, which was really incredibly difficult, but I think it looks super good. Um, what else did we do, Will? bought a popcorn popper. Oh, we bought a popcorn popper. I bought a popcorn popper because I love it. Oh, can't uh, forget all the flooring. It used to be carpet. We tore all the carpet out and put this in all by ourselves. I think it looks pretty dang good. Flooring, baseboards. Flooring, baseboards. Um, every wall, changed every outlet cover. Yes, yes, we did all those things. Um, anything else that is incredible to note? Blinds. Oh yeah, we put up we went. Premium blinds that you can just touch. Yeah. Look at this. Yeah. Great job. So, there you have it. That's our house. Uh, we hope that you'll come visit sometime because we have a nice guest room for you. And we'll probably evict that spider before you come. Um, oh, I don't know if you saw, but we've got this good uh, deck area outside we've got a grill so we'll grill you food some good veggies probably some meat we'll our next kind of big quest is to get this wood up and running clean it off and restain it there's a school back there and so I don't know if you can see the soccer ball here but we get two or three balls in here a day that we have to just drop kick back which is actually kind of fun anything else you'd like to tell our esteemed viewers Uh, we're we're very enthused about home ownership. Uh, no, it's really cool, and it really feels interesting and exciting that we did all this ourselves. We, I mean, we had a lot of help from people, but um, at the end of the day, we put in our sweat and came out good. Yeah, totes. Okay, see you later. I hope you are having a delightful day.